Ladies, it's Lexus Joy from Lexus Joy VIP Access, and I'm so thrilled to be catching up with the stupendous Lisa Vanderpump here today at the premiere of her documentary. Now, can you tell us a little bit about this incredible and impactful documentary of yours? Well, it's been an arduous journey, but it's wonderful to see it come to fruition. I stand here beside my partner, Dr. John Setter, who's actually been to Yulin, and my husband, you know, has also been like the guiding force behind us. But we've done everything we can. We've done marches and rallies but this week has been such a sad week you know just for the country and I think it really sends a message to all of us that it's so scary of what can transpire like and I think it, it's really about loving each other and showing humanity and empathy not just to our animals but to each other and I think we've been devastated I've had a very sad week this week having lost two of my pet dogs and that's my personal sadness but I've also been overwhelmed with sadness that's what transpired. And so this film is a film, and it's, I do believe it's an important film. I do believe like Blackfish made a difference and The Cove made a difference. And I'm hoping this will. I'm hoping it will incite anger. I'm hoping it will guide people to support resolution uh, for 401. 401. Right. Yes. So, and this is my partner. He's actually been there and seen it firsthand. You know, and so. we really think it's important for people to really understand what's going on and see it firsthand. And obviously it was difficult for us to film it and it was difficult for us to make the film but I mean I really do think that it's necessary in order to really make a difference I think when shit goes down that's when you've got to start fighting and I think this has been you know a huge wake up call this week about you know restricting or, well you know that's a political conversation probably that I shouldn't get into tonight but you know it's courage in the face of adversity as well isn't it now I know that you've done so much with your work with the Vanderpump Dogs Foundation. You have done World Dog Day and everything like that. So what inspired the documentary itself? Well, I think that was just kind of the the final thing that we felt we could do to make a difference in our fight against you. And we've marched, we've done, we've opened our own dog rescue center where we've adopted out 250 dogs already. Yeah. John's been very involved with that, so has my husband. So, you know, it was just one more thing that we could do. But as I say, in light of what's gone down this week it's just so important that we're not just focused on this tonight even though this is of utmost importance to us but that we really you know try and have a better understanding of what empathy and compassion and kindness means well thank you guys so much for speaking with me and thank you really for making such an impact in so many lives